Ladies and gentlemen, it is I, Teddy Robinson. We are here. Welcome back to another episode of Teddy's New Vegas Permadeath Experience. I'm happy to be here. We're just going to jump right into it. Life gets tough, but sometimes life is just life. You are a courier by the name of Duncan O'Toole. Um, you... <laughs> You are a courier by the name of Duncan O'Toole on a routine mission delivering a platinum poker chip. You were ambushed and, in fact, shot in the head. One second, let me make an adjustment. You were, in fact, shot in the head. It turns out later you were making that delivery for a guy called Mr. House, a mysterious feller who resides in that there tower. Um, that tower is, in fact, the Lucky 38 Casino. You don't know exactly what his intentions are, although maybe in some previous lives you may or may not have figured it out. Um, your bestie is Boone, who we who doesn't look too uh, happy ever um, because his wife died. His wife was taken. Uh, his wife was taken by um, a group of people. Well, rather large, alarmingly large group of people called the Legion, uh, who intended to put her, his wife, into slavery. He avoided this by shooting her in the head. That's right. To save her from becoming a slave, the only way for him was to murder her. Um, now, we have Eddie here as well. And this guy, don't we have something for this guy? Wait one second. Do we have some heads in here? No, that was a different, that was a different life. For a second I thought we had some heads in here. Doesn't matter. Anyway. Our goal initially was to stick with Boone and get to know him better. Well, it's still the goal. In fact, I've figured out how we can still get to know him quite well. However, for this very moment, I believe it's in everybody's best interest to leave Boone behind for a little while. Um, in fact, we are going to travel to the Grub and Gulp. Now, now that we have been blessed with another life, a life we did not expect to have. This is not the rest stop. This is not... Whoa! This is not where I expected to go, actually. But there are some traders, and I want to see what they got. Whoa! Oh my god, it's the Legion! Ah! Right into the battle! Stay away from my friends! Shit! Jeez! Uh, um... Well, I might be over encumbered, but we got a trader right there, so I'm just gonna trade. Yeah, just do a take all on all of these, and then sell it all. Hey, I'm sorry about that. Hey there. Need anything? Yeah, they were here for me. I was oh, sorry. <sighs> that that was um wow. That was unexpected, wasn't it? Jeez. Oh man, this this okay, so I actually have some opinions about what what just transpired. Um, and I'll share them. I'll, I'll share them with you shortly. Wow, words. We don't need any of these, as we do not uh, make use of that kind of weaponry. 
You can have all of these, but in fact, you should have the apparel first, because that's that's what weighs the most. Metal helmet reinforced. We keep that, and we get rid of these two. Wow, that was uh, woof. Oh, wow, we uh, you can have that laser pistol. I don't think we'll really be using these laser RC RCW. I'll keep one for now. Because we have EC packs and we might run out of MF cells. Yeah, we might. So, if and when that happens, we need a solution. Um, let's go over here. Okay, we do still have everything. Selling stuff real quick, we will keep all of this. Doesn't weigh anything anyway. Don't need that, don't need that, don't need that. We'll keep those too. Yeesh! Well, at least uh, we're making some money off of this. Brahmin never have anything, even though they're the pack things. Hey, what are you? Where are they going? Who are you sneaking up to? You slept through all of this. You're a terrible mercenary, by the way. Oh, oh, oh! <laughs> what was this sneaking for? Did you steal somebody's whatever that is? Cardboard? Hi, I want to trade. Hey there. Need anything? Yeah, I. You sound. Are you guys twins? Are you a twin of the person we just talked to? Because you sound and look exactly alike. Believe it or not. Old cowboy hat. Mm, okay, medics, by the way. We buy all medics. We see a medics, we buy a medics. We're simple. Oh, we did not need the fork. Uh, let's see. You can have the 10 milli. I keep those. You can have that as well. Uh, that's really it, isn't it? Ba -ba, ba -ba. Oh man! Huh. This uh, this came at me quick. I was just here chilling, and wow, that just went very fast. Okay, so. This is actually the reason, like, so the Legion is mad at us. Which is why they're sending people after us to hurt us. Mean people. Oh, a super sledge. Cool. I'll keep that on me for now. Um, yeah, I don't, we don't need to do that much for money. But the reason the Legion came after us is because they're angry. But the problem is, in order to get to know Boone better, he wants you to make the Legion angry. Now, seeing as this, we are very far into this playthrough. Not this particular playthrough, but all the playthroughs. We are reaching end status. There are a couple of quests I still want to do. Um, one of them is I want to finally get to know the Brotherhood of Steel properly and do their quest. However, we can't do that when the Legion's mad at us because it requires extensive exploration. So what I'm actually going to do is I'm going to make temporary peace with the Legion and then we're gonna do our quests um, and for that where is it oh it's here that's where I wanted to go and a part of what I want to do also is going to require me to send Boone home yes he's our Fine bestie oh you got a lot of stuff Right, I forgot about all of this. I forgot I gave you all this. Oh, uh, are there any traders here? Do you have money? Back for more? You have nothing. That's exactly what you have. Nothing. Um. Okay, I'll need to. This is unexpected. I'll need to ch go back to the grub and gulp. Grub and gulp. Are the traders still here? All the traders left. Of course. 
They're all gone. They heard the Legion was coming over. They're like, no. Oh, wait, wait. I see a Brahmin. That's a good sign. Let's chase down that traitor real quick. Um, oof. We're actually going to send Boone home for a little while. Mainly because I find it really important for this playthrough to do his quest. I really, really, really want to do Boone's quest. I really want to do Boone's quest. Why well, you got a lot of mercenaries with you? You are one packed traitor. Hi, you got hey money? Need oh, you're new. You got no money? Come on. What's that about? No money and nothing I want to buy. That, well, that's just, that's just, that isn't that rich. In fact, we're going to go all the way down to Novak to make this trade happen. It's really important for this playthrough for me to actually, actually um, get to do Boone's quest. Find now... Me. What would be the number one thing that would get in the way really easily of us doing Boone's quest? That thing would be... I'm sure you guys understand. That would be a dead Boone. Hey so if Boone dies... Well, that's the end of it. Uh, uh, oh, we're going to have to take the slow walk home. You don't have money at all either. Hey Nobody has money. I got good stuff. I got the good shit. So what's the deal? Give me money. There we go. We're gonna take the slow walk. The slow walk. Might go to Cliff. Clive? Cliff. Yeah, if Boone dies, why are you here, Victor? Why are you here? You're supposed to meet us in Vegas. If Boone dies, that will be tragic. So, I'm, I'm not, my, my explanation. Simply put, in order to get to know Boone, we have to piss off the Legion. Meaning they're going to send lots of mercenaries, lots of assassins like they just did. Meaning that, after we get to know Boone, the assassins will come and keep coming. No, that's not a dirty joke. They'll just keep trying to track us down and murder us. Come on. Come on. Welcome back. So that's why we're getting rid of Boone temporarily. Sure thing. Have a look. You also have nothing. What's the deal here? Nobody has money. A varmint rifle scope? What am I going to do with the varmint rifle scope? Jeez. Oh, okay. I don't know. I'll just, just keep it all. Just keep the, I just don't even want to deal with it anymore. We're going to take the slow walk back. So, what are the quests we still want to do, you might ask. Well, I really want to do the Brotherhood. I already mentioned this. The Brotherhood is really the only thing. And that brings, you to, brings us to Black Mountain, where we've never been either. So that's something I'd really want to do. And then, there of course is Boone's Quest. After that, we want to start orienting ourselves on which faction we would actually really like to side with. I'm thinking not an NCR run. I'm thinking not a Legion run. Well, of course, we have to piss off the Legion significantly in order to get Boone to like us, to let us in. All right, let's stash all this stuff because this is too heavy. Um, stupid Nectar, we don't need that. Anti-Venom doesn't weigh anything. That's just food. How would you can just keep it, but it's not really necessary. It's all stuff that we have that just kind of weighs us down. Kind of annoying, really. Let's put 15 of them in here. 
Let's uh, put all our drain stuff. Let's duct tape the wonder glue, the wrenches. Mm -hmm. Let's regular. And the overcharge. Let's also put the super sledge in here. We won't be using it. Super sledge. Laser RCW. We'll take that with us because we are going to run out. So I think we're good. And I think, Eddie, you have a bunch too, right? Yeah, Eddie has 30 Sunset Sarsaparilla. Let's put that away as well. I'm excited to see where this will go. Let's see. Da -da -da -da. Um, I'm an aide. Yes. Let's put all 30 away. We got a big collection. Boone. What is it? We should part ways for now. If that's what you think. Yes, what I think. All right. Guess I'll be around Novak for a while longer until I figure out what I want to do with myself. See you around. I'll see you soon, Boone. We'll see you very soon. Let's take a eight-hour nap. Why don't we? A decadent nap. Let's get Veronica, who is a part of the Brotherhood, which is perfect because we are trying to reach the Brotherhood. Um, we need to level up a couple times in order to do a couple of things that we need. But for now, just do that. And what am I doing here? I'm drinking. And we're eating. This fruit really doesn't do anything in the terms of food. Weird. Um, let's have the wasteland omelet. There we go. Veronica is over there. It's an NCR trading post. We'll need to level up a couple times because we need speech and we need one extra luck, in fact. No offense, but you look like you've traveled a long way down some bad roads. Yeah. Where'd you come Tell me from? about it. Good Springs, the grave. Good Springs. Wow, you have come a long way then. I've never been there, but I've met some traders who passed that way. Cool. Well, welcome then. I'm Veronica. I live in a hole in the ground. Very cool. Live in a hole in the ground? Well, a bunker, if you want to get technical. But I'm not there much anymore. I'm usually out here. Just leave your family out there? Yeah. I'm yeah, yeah. Go ahead. Usually harmless. Well, that shouldn't be a problem for me. I can't afford anything like that. Hey, so where are you headed anyway? Um, We're going to uh, the strip right now. Ooh. I'll be honest. You're the. F there are places I've never been to that. What do you bring to the table? Hmm. Good. That's the look I was going for. If I. Okay. Now you're talking. One thing you should know first, though. I ask you about the Brotherhood because I'm one of them. I know, I know, but you still. Look yep. I'm well, thanks for taking. That's it. All right, we now have Ronnie with us, who sometimes wears her weapon, sometimes not. Apparently, that's weird. Ooh, Ronnie, that's good for me. welcome. Is it a dress? A dress? Ronnie, no. Oh, we got the leather. Uh, do I keep the combat? Give her the leather? No, no, I don't want. That's a ten. That's a five DT difference. There we go. Ooh, got something good for me? Yes. Is it a dress? S stop it. <laughs> you look ridiculous, Veronica. But we're here to make sure you don't die, so you know. 
Hi, I want to sell some stuff. You can really lure a person like this anywhere, even to their death. Because they'll just keep following you until they finally get close enough to initiate conversation. Back for more? That's a weird thing to say. Names. Oh, you have two caps. Right. And you have nothing else. Okay. Bye bye. Alright, Ronnie, let's hit the strip. Um, yeah, let's hit the north gate, I guess. East gate? Sure. Any gate. Whoa! What happened out there? I heard shots? Oh, right there. There we go. Another one. That one had a gun. I'll check that out real quick. There we go. As we all know, you gain, uh... A lot of karma for killing fiends, which is uh, an interesting choice by the developers. There we go. Alright. Temporary peace with the Legion. I know they'll want to make peace with us. As soon as we've done a thing to a certain someone. And procured an item. Dixon, you trash human being. You live another day, Dixon. That uh that was that was downright embarrassing. Watch out. Let's watch Ronnie in action. Okay, uh, Ronnie out there going crazy. Dum, 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 dum. Okay, this isn't my favorite gate, I will say that. This is kind of a walk around. Hmm. There definitely aren't any real good gates. Like, there's the strip is kind of like hard to, to access. It can be bought, it can be found, it make it. Which is unfortunate. The Kings. Oh, I want to buy some, um... You want someone dead? Really dead? Stop by the Silver Rush and we'll give you the me. I actually do want to go to the Silver Rush. Because I want to buy some energy, uh, stuff. I... I'm afraid I'm going to have to search you. Yep. There we go. Now they're going to have a whole... Mr. Shebang that we have to wait the for. Ooh, free guns. You good? Ah, I think I understand what the issue here is. Excuse me for a moment, would you? Do it. Never break faith with the Van Graffs, Mr. Soren. Never I break faith. We'll have the rest of our payment ready tomorrow morning. Okay, everyone. Show's over. Back to work. Yep. Hi, uh... Money? <laughs> Two bottle caps. Hey. Hi, hello. Welcome to the Silver Rush. Yep, yep. You can have my leather armor. And from you, I want... Ooh, Gatling laser. Beam splitter. Did we already have that? Yeah, we have that. Not exactly a whole lot. I just want microfusion cells. 
Microfusion cell bulk? I don't know what that means. Does that mean we get a lot of microfusion cells? I'll try it. Yeah, what does that mean? Okay, so I get the bulk microfusion cells. Uh, holy hell, that's a lot of energy weapons. Yeah, sure is. Wait, does that mean just we got a lot of microfusion cells? Bulk. What does bulk mean? Oh, it's not as good. They're not as good. I can live with that, actually. Welcome to the Silver Rush. I'll take all of them. Yeah, that's perfect. Uh, where is it? Microfusion cell bulk? Bulk microfusion cell? Where'd it go? What? You just had it. Wait. Train microfusion cell electron. Uh, You, you, Gloria, you just had them. I didn't buy all of them. This is confusing me. Okay, well, I'll just buy the regular ones then. 480, uh, pricey. Meanwhile, you can have a bunch of this random stuff that we never use. Um, anyway, it's fine for now. We dropped the ball on that one. Cool. Let's go. Let's get. Hey. Give me my stuff. Welcome to the Silver Rush. New Vegas is back. All right. Best source of laser and plasma. Now on to make temporary piece. Mm -hmm. Always so thirsty. Let's go to the strip. 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 Yeah, 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 yeah. Ronnie, handle it. Ronnie? Ronnie? Where are you? Okay. Well, Eddie, thank you for doing that. Let's see uh, what is next. There's some minis over there. Like old Ben's gonna shoot him too. Get it, old Ben. Get him. Get him, old Ben. Good job. They never have any money. Halt. Submit to a credit check. They just need to know you have enough money to make it work. Someone's gonna run in here and get shot. They just want you to want to check if you have enough money. Howdy, partner. Hi. You've come for a piece, haven't you? Sure have. Welcome to New Vegas. Where do I start? The place to get started. That's where you find me. All right. Yeah. And there we go. All right. Classic. Totally classic. Let's try again. I probably saved recently. I'm in a habit of saving a lot. When you play a Bethesda game, you know you got to save a bunch. And I probably have done just that. Oh, easy. Howdy, partner. Howdy, partner. I'll 
Point me to the tabs, Victor. I've got a score to settle. Sorry, Rambler. I know you're fixing Rambler? to serve up some vengeance, but I'm a... Ain't that a kick in the head? Now, you guys, uh, wait here. Oh, no, I didn't mean to. You guys wait. Ronnie. Should have brought something to read. Should have brought something to read. I can, I'll give you a magazine. You're making me carry the heavy stuff, aren't you? <sighs> you wanted something to read! Um, how about, yeah, a nice, uh, this is about meeting people. No, I want that. Actually, I might need that. Um, you can read about, um, where did it all go? I thought we had more. You can read how to fix things. There you go. Well, howdy, partner. That's right. We're going into the lucky 38. My head keeps spinning. Where to, partner? Well, there's only one way to go. Oh, one place. Well, hello. Hi. I got a snow globe for the snow globe collection. You do? 2,000 money. Four. Enjoy all the Vegas Strip has to offer. Mr. House. This meeting has been a long time coming, hasn't it? You've come a long ways, literally and, I suspect, figuratively as well. I have to ask, now that you've reached your destination, what do you make of what you see? Never seen anything like this place. Of course you haven't. Vegas always was one of a kind. Uh -huh. What you see down on the strip is just a fraction of the city's former glory, and yet, Ooh. more than an echo, I preserved its spirit. Or perhaps you were referring to the Lucky 38? The years haven't been kind to her, but still she manages to impress. I'm just a courier. Oh, don't be coy. You've been playing a high-stakes game ever since Victor dug you out of the ground. Don't be afraid to admit it. Fine, I won't be. Let's get down to business then. The business is this. One of my employees has stolen an item of extraordinary value from me. And I want it recovered. Simple enough. What do you propose? My only concern is the recovery of the platinum chip. What happens to Benny, I leave to your discretion. When you bring the chip to me, I will pay you four times the delivery bonus stipulated in your contract. How's that? I accept your terms. Well enough. Return to... Hmm... Who exactly are you? I am Robert Edwin House, President, CEO, and sole proprietor of the new Vegas Strip. I oversaw the city's renovations starting from 2274 onward. Before the Great War of 2077, I was the founder, president, and CEO of Robco Industries, a vast computer and robotics corporation. You appear to be a computer. Don't let the video screens and computer terminals fool you. I'm flesh and blood, not silicone. Must be like a brain in a jar. How have you stayed alive, alive all this time? Let's just say it was very... costly. But I was willing to make the sacrifices longevity entailed. That's the financial thing. Financial and otherwise. That's the thing, I don't really know what his purpose is. Congratulations. You, you, and Thank you, I'll go to the cocktail lounge because... Ba -da 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 -da. Ba -da 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 -da. Bam. 
snow globe, which by the way, I think I heard a teensy tiny spoiler about the snow globes. And there was always one I couldn't find. I found all but one in my last playthrough, one before last. And I do believe hey, you there. I have a message for you. It's from Ambassador Crocker. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Yep, I'm coming out of the 38. I'm very cool. Aw, oh, just when the standing around was getting... You can't help but notice that the Brotherhood barely exists to these people out here. We're like an urban myth. Yep. No real presence on the outside. We just don't adapt like we should. It used to be that all you needed to get your way was a suit of power armor and a laser rifle. Now, people are armed and organized. They're yep. afraid. But we still stick to our old approach because it's all we know. Mm hmm. The Brotherhood is living in the past. Eventually, they'll have to change. Oh, that's a tough one. Um, power armor and laser rifles are still effective. Yeah, but only if you've got bodies to fill the suits. We don't take on new members. We're all descendants from the original Brotherhood. Damn. Something's going to have to change, or the empty suits are going to be all that's left of us. I like long walks in the desert and candlelit metal workshops. Ever been in love? What a question to ask. Sure. Ever been nosy? I was. Once. We were pretty young, but I like to think it was love. Wow. That's crazy. Damn. Yeah, they do need to change, huh? So she supports the change. Well, now we know. It's hard to sleep in this place, I tell you. Ha! Ba ba ba! Who are you, huh? Alright, let's go get Ben. Hey, hey, baby doll. Oh, and a friend. We done this many a times. We're just kind of speed running along. Benny's right over here. He's gonna say like, "Oh, hold up, easy now, easy now." What in the goddamn? Let's keep this in the hell. Yep, 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 yep. Yes, we are going to sleep with Benny. And for some reason, we're taking uh, Eddie and Veronica with us. Don't really understand either. But, alright. It's, uh, it's here? Hey, there's the high roller. No. No. No oh. sudden moves around the boss, got it? Uh, there will be. <laughs> here we go. Oh, here we go. Yeah. The 13th floor. All right, Benny, open it up. Hurry up. <laughs> Let's see, um, ooh, Benny. You know what? I'm not even gonna give him the pleasure. Benny's gonna show you the tops. I hope you're built sturdy, you crazy broad. Let's go. You t Hey! Oh! Come on! <laughs> We're beating him up. Oh, 
Oh my god, he's strong! I thought Veronica would have unarmed skill since she uses unarmed. Yeesh. That took some work. That really took some work. Um, we need to get the science 75. That's what we're working on. Strong back, stone wall. Scrounger, quick draw, commando. This is really good. Hmm. I really do like stone wall. Five damage threshold against melee weapons and unarmed attacks. Because those can be really, really dangerous. But then again, this is... This is three all the time. So that might be the better option. I'm going to go for that. There we go. Let's talk to Yes Man real quick. Hey, cool. Just to unstart start that quest. Well, let's see. Uh All right. Well, we'll go back down. That was a tough time. We just had a really tough time. Luckily, everything's still in working order. Hello. You okay? <laughs> Take it slow. Okay, what are we doing next? We, um, so the reason we went to do this is because we want a temporary, a temporary chill time with the Legion. And this is what will allow us to have that because as soon as we get out of here, the Legion will be like, any past things are forgiven if you meet with Kaisar. The eyes of the mighty Kaisar. Accept. So that means no assassin squads for now. Which is great. Now, next up, we need one more level. Um, and we need to go to Hidden Valley. Which I can only do from memory. Where is that again? It's not that. It's this. It might be that. It might not be. No. Oh, where is it again? Here? No. Here? No. Where is it again? I should have remembered better. Well, anyway, what matters is that we go to Black Mountain, which is here, I believe. And so we'll just go and do that first. Because we need to go there and we need to collect some power armors that are laying around. Find some, uh, yeah. That's just something we simply need to do. 
So first we'll get some implants because we do have some money. 11k to be exact. Oh, and of course, I totally forgot to forgot about the snow globe. So there's, I find it a bit strange that this game apparently has two snow globes, both in the strip. Could have been done differently. But uh, yeah, I, I, I low-key spoiled myself on where the snow globe was. The last snow globe that I still needed. That means we can now start working on collecting everything. Hello. You got a globe somewhere and I intend to find it. Is it somewhere in this vast vault of yours? Not here yet. And yes, we are doing the game a bit speed running now because you know what? It's time. It's time. We are getting pretty far. Okay, let's try here first. Maybe it's in our room. Maybe we have to rent the room first. Should have done that actually. No, no. Hmm. hmm. Not there. It's a small vault, so should be around. I am uh, disoriented. Is this how we came? Yeah, I believe so. Mm -hmm. Oh, nope, nope, nope. That's how we came. We might have to rent this room in order to be able to get the snow globe. Oh, big vault. Big vault alert. Wow. What? This place is massive. Why? I wonder. Was there like, had they intended to do more with this originally? I'm hearing people, but I'm not seeing people. Which is very spooky. Um, okay. Yo, this place is a maze. <gasps> There we go, looks cute. Looks just like the vault from uh, Fallout 3. Yeah, nobody's around. Snow globe. Oh, snow globe. Uh. James B, welcome. Good to see you again, James Blake. Welcome, welcome. How's your new streaming service? Ah, just kidding. You don't know about the streaming service. The, the, the other James Blake is starting a streaming service. Now we're looking around the vault because a little birdie told us that there was a snow globe here. Oh, hi. Who are you? Gambler. Strip letter three. Okay. Oh, that didn't do much. Gambler is just sleeping. Okay. Wow, this vault is so big. Ooh, fresh water. Mm -hmm. Fresh water is nice. Vault 21 locker. Ooh, nothing. What a big vault. This is this is a very 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 huge vault. I am actually kind of perplexed at how big this vault is. Really a lot here. No snow globe yet. So yeah. Have you seen what happened to us, James? Do you realize that this is a new character? <laughs> this place is so huge. 
I don't even know anymore. Um, this globe should be somewhere, but uh, what happened? Man, I don't know what happened, but like, I was doing a quest for the NCR. Not even a crazy quest, just one of the later quests. And I walked up to one of their rangers, and the ranger pointed his gun and said, like, stop. And then he, like, only, like, one and a half second later, he started shooting. And then all of the NCR started shooting at us, and then we just, that was it. Okay, I can't find it. Where is this thing? So, yeah, they literally just started shooting. And then now it was over. Oh, this is a new area. Which is so bizarre. Really super, super unexpected. Come on, vault. Who's doing, who's doing some jet here? Sounds like a classic bug. I don't even know. I think it seems like it was intended. It seems like we were just not supposed to come close to a certain area. And that would make them, oh. Ah, we don't even. So it seems like it was just about that area, but like, man, that really, really sucked. So out of nowhere, we lost a 17 hour run. 17 is a lot. <laughs> We're going deep. Oh, oh, okay. So yeah, we are back at the beginning with a new character. I will say that it's, uh, that, that was a lot. That kind of broke my spirit, I'm not gonna lie. I was like, oh no, because I really thought that was gonna be the last run. I really thought we had it in the bag. I really thought it was done. Yeah, I simply don't know, uh, I, I simply don't know how to get there. It's probably, if I have to guess, it's in our room. Why are there all these letters? If I have to guess, it's in our room. So we just have to go and get our room. This place is a total, total, total maze. So, ah, that was sad. And then the one right after that, we died of dehydration. <laughs> Apparently you can dehydrate in this game. I didn't know that was possible. I knew you got thirsty. But I didn't think it would kill you if you waited too long. So we wanted to wait for three days for some NPCs, the NPCs of Novak, to not be angry at us anymore. Because we were stealing, they got angry. Okay, this place is a maze. I, uh, here? And then so we, I just pressed wait for three days. And then we were dead. <laughs> Literally just from that. Okay, that's also not it. So yeah, that was tough. So we just been hit with a spree of really, 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 really bad luck, essentially. Really bad luck. I'm trying to turn it around now, and I'm trying to make a positive thing out of it by doing some quests that we uh, had forgotten or weren't able to do. Hi, can I have a room? Hi, I'm Sarah, Sarah Weintraub. Welcome to the finest vault hotel so, in the yeah. whole world. I like a room. All right, we have an available. Sounds good. Go all the way down to the vault's main hub. Your room's in the hallway to the left. Vault's main hub? Room is in a hallway to the left? That doesn't help at all. Sarah, what the hell? Main hub. All the way down, she said? Main hub. Room is to the left in a hallway. This better be it. No. Oh God. Who was in charge of this? Who did this part of the game? I'm so lost. Room is in a hallway. 
These are a lot of hallways. Ugh, this is just, this is painful. I can't even find my room in this damn place. Oh, hello, a lot of peeps. Hi. Hey. Hi. Whoa, there are a lot of people here. Very cool. Very cool. No one we can talk to? Nope, all gamblers. Morning. Are you? No. This is, uh, this is crazy. What kind of design is this? This is too damn large. Okay. Ah! Nope, it's not our, it's not our place. Cause she gave us a key. What is this? I am, I am, I am, I am at a loss for words at this point. This is too much. What is even, what even constitutes a main hub? Is this the main hub? Is this the main hub? Doesn't look so main-y. What the hell? Well, that's not it. Good lord, we are running, we are walking in circles now too. This looks like it could be a main hub. This is crazy. Who would do such a thing? Who would do such a thing? Oh, we haven't been here. Okay. Hey. Hi. But there's nothing there, I think. What? The worst part is if I leave, I'll have to come back because <laughs> cause the damn snow globe is here. Okay. Let's uh, try to get to a different level because it might just not be on this level. Let's go up. Who would do, who would, who would design this? Who would design this and be like, oh, a beautiful vault. Very nicely done, if I do say so myself. This is the worst day of my life. This is the main hub. How the hell did the monorail blow up? Someone's bringing bad luck into the strip, I tell you. Yeah, the monorail did blow up. So we come in from here, I believe. No. We come in from here originally, I believe. No. Oh, what are, James, what is happening? I'm leaving. I'm out. I'm not doing it anymore. I'm not doing it anymore. Um, this is this is this is this has gone on quite long enough. This oh, wow, what? No, just no. Uh uh, not happening. <sighs> Let's get out of this hellhole. It's just so wow. That was overwhelming. I uh, wow. I want my money Good back. You again. I want my money back. Are you the owner? Well, it is my vault, all right. I mean, I take care of it, but I. 
Mr. House has everything to do with Vault 21. Uh. He tried to get us out before he filled it with concrete. Hey, Rez, what's up? Eight. Super far so from the last him. death okay, of dehydration, buddy. Not, oh, right? my God. <laughs> the dehydration was so bad, but Rez, welcome back. Good to see you. Oh. Why do you fill it with concrete? I don't know. Maybe my vault runs deep and wide. What gives him the right to screw us with the royal shaft anyway? All right. Oh, man. Yeah, no, the dehydration death was so funny. We're pretty far. We're doing all right. We're doing all right. We're getting there, you know? Okay, well, if we're not doing that, then I guess we're going to go to Black Mountain. Oh, but at first I want to get some implants. One thing I don't truly understand is where you can where the clinic is. I thought the clinic was around here maybe. New Vegas clinic. I always thought it was like here ish. Let's just see. She pays caps for vault suits that girl. Yes, and apparently there's um apparently there's um, one of the snow globes in there, but I cannot for the life of me find it. Okay, let's find the Vegas clinic and get our implants. That'll be step, the next step. It's beside the Crimson Caravan, right? That's where I am. So it should be here somewhere. That's what I thought as well. It's not these buildings, I know that much. We're gonna search. It's in her bedroom on a nightstand, I think. Oh, really? Okay, we're going back. There it is. Because we were walking through that vault everywhere, and it was a maze. It was a true maze. Oh, we got some baddies out here? Oh. We just beat Benny to death with our bare fists. Us and Veronica. It was kind of a sight to behold. It took a long time. He took us so long to go down. Okay, that person's far away. We're gonna, whoever that is, we're gonna leave them alive. There we go. Hi. Welcome to the new Vegas. If you. I want an implant. I have. I've. I just literally want to be more lucky. If I implant the probability count. Have. There we go. Literally. We are literally going here for seven luck. Reason being, we need it for a quest. And I just think seven luck is pretty good. Want to buy another one? Wait, how much do we have? How much money do we have? If we have 8.5k? No, we don't! You're back. Oh, no, I don't, actually. Um, do you have... Do you have money? Not enough. You can have this. You can have this, I guess. You rob the casinos? Like, rob them how? Like, just play, play a game? Because I haven't really gambled yet, actually. We mainly just play caravan and make money that way? Someone blew up the monorail right by our troops. Yeah, I know. I, I, I'm part responsible for the monorail. I'm sorry. What do you have? Oh, he's got money. That's good. Oh, he's got a lot of tens. I'll take them all. Uh, I'll take the four clubs. Oh! I... Yeah, 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 yeah. Blackjack is great with high luck. Ooh, or get banned from casinos already. I should try that actually. Let's see, is the game going to start? Is the game going to boot up? I don't know if the game's going to boot up. Oh, there we go. There's a familiar sound. No, maybe we should do that actually. I'm just really, really bad at blackjack. But I can probably learn. There we go. 
even on Xbox. Yeah, this is a crashy, crashy game. It's especially crashy, actually, when you're buying cards. When you're buying uh, caravan cards. If you're looking to buy her. Of course, he's going to have completely different stuff. Oh, he has it all. There we go. There we go. Oh, no, he doesn't. It's different. I'm just going to leave and save every time I buy something. Hey there. You me. Oh, I don't want to talk to you. Or beat the dealer. Um, let's see. Mm -hmm. Queen, don't really need a queen. A jack and a king we do need. Thank you. Thank you. That is great. Hey there. You look Here we go. A nine we do need. Yes. A seven we do need. A six of clubs we do need. All right, we bought a lot of cards. We got to save again. Yeah, no, we'll definitely go to the casino at some point and actually do some real, real gambling. That'd be fun. Um, for now, he can just have the Maria. And then we're done with it. Then we have enough for the implant. Then we're broke, but we have enough for the implant. I, damage threshold is really, really important to me. I don't know exactly how the damage threshold calculations go. I just know that I, I always make sure that I have it. Hi. You're back. I'll take Oh no, wait, what am I doing in the store? Implant. Greater strength. Subdermal. That's the one. Oh, it's only 8k. Hey uh, There we go. We spent a lot of money. Rez, where is the three main casinos are worth it for a no glitch or pure run? For sure, we're definitely not doing glitches, so we should go there and get some money. Um, first though, what we're gonna do now is we're actually gonna go to Black Mountain. It's gonna be shitty, but we gotta do it. It's gonna be a tough time. Uh. Let's see. Um, I don't actually know where. Is that where? No. That's Black Mountain there, right? Where's Hidden Valley? Do you guys know where Hidden Valley is? Anyway, we're going to go Black Mountain first. There's caps in the main building at Sloan. Ah, wait, Sloan? There we go. Quick takeout. Wait, is Eddie fighting? Oh, Eddie's fighting. Nobody touches our Eddie. What? Are we being shot at? Stop it. It's on the way. Ah, okay. Perfect. Don't need that. Probably don't need this. Yeah, we've been there before. But I must say I completely forgot where it is. That's the correctional facility. Still doing the energy weapons run too. Yes, we haven't died since dehydration. What? Where? 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 Where are they? Where are they? Oh, there. 
There we go. Hmm. There's two behind there. Interesting. Just follow the road and a guy will stop you. They're behind this, but... I don't think they're coming out. I like how they all die instantly. What? Where are they? That's weird. Oh, I'm really scared of dying. I really don't want to die anymore. I think if we go beyond this, there's going to be death. Oh, what's that? Oh, yeah, that's Quarry Junction. We got to be careful of death claws too, I think. I think that's the entrance to Quarry Junction, isn't it? If I'm not mistaken. And then Black Mountain is right there. So we have to go through Quarry Junction to get to Black Mountain, which is just the scariest thing I've ever seen in my life. We 100% cannot deal with a death claw right now. Sloan is right before the quarry. Ah, is this Sloan? Ah, yeah, there it is. Hold up. There are death claws all over the damn place north. If you want to get to New Vegas, you're better off heading east from Prim and then looping north. They moved into the quarry after the powder gangers came through. We shut the quarry down while we waited. Have you ever seen a death claw? They're taller than a man and far, far stronger and faster. You'd have to be the meanest, toughest, roughest <laughs> bastard in the way. You'd need to take out the pack leaders, the mother death claw and the death claw alpha. Yish. Okay, yeah, so as far as I'm aware, in order to get to Black Mountain, we have to walk this way, right? And that's the part that I'm worried about. It's best to sneak to the right. Yeah, that's what I thought too. I'm really worried a Deathclaw is going to come and kill Ronnie. Like, there's blips on the map right now. I hope those aren't Deathclaws. Like, what are these? Are those Deathclaws too? There's so many red blips! What the hell? It's covered in red lips? Huh. Yeah, that much I know. So I know what to expect there, but I just need to be able to get there. Oh, that's luckily just one of those guys. You can go... Don't get too excited. Don't get too excited. Easy now. Danger of what? Danger of what? Danger of what? Okay, okay, we're good. Now this, if I'm not mistaken, is Hidden Valley, right? So we could go to Hidden Valley first. But we need speech 50. There's a speech 50 check really early on. So we shouldn't do that yet. Danger of what exactly? Danger of what? Huh. Oh. 
Alter. There we go. Yeah, we there's a speech 50 check here in order to progress. So we'll have to wait. That's a lot of them. Oh. Whoa. Where's Ronnie? Ron? Oh, there. Okay. Let's ah! Jeez. Uh. Let's take some anti venom. And a stim pack, honestly. And some water. And some food, apparently, because now we're hungry, too. Okay, on to Black Mountain. All right, let's make sure we don't run into a death claw. I really don't want to run into a death claw. But I think this is already the NPC. Oh, it got so bright all of a sudden with Vegas. Here we go. Yeah, I think we'll be all right. I think there is a bunch of hostile Nightkin. Might have to take them out. Hi. This is a dangerous place, human, especially for your kind. I suggest you turn back. There's nothing good waiting for you further on. What makes this a dangerous place? You must have heard a radio broadcast. Though why a human would follow her invitation here is beyond me, unless she didn't listen very closely. Did not listen. The voice on the radio belongs to Tabitha, the supreme commander of Black Mountain, or as she calls it, the state of Utopia. She took control Ooh. of this place almost two years ago. The super mutants here do whatever she says, and she says humans are to be killed on sight. Oh, we need to level speech. Oh, I'm so regret not leveling speech early game. You seem friendly. Keep saying things like that and I won't be so friendly. I'm sorry. Not every super many of us are just as intelligent as basic Damn. humans. And the rest don't Save really my boys to sneak to through. Oh. Ah, we'll just we'll try to shoot him. Mm -mm -mm. Just come back later? Ah, you don't think we can take him? No offense intended. And none take. Because we do have to go here. Hmm. Is that a nightkin? No. Blips on the radar. Ah. Uh, this is very scary. All right. This is very scary. Oh, there they are. Oh, what is that? What kind of gun does he have? That's a big gun. What 
kind of gun is that? Is that a fat man or something? Will that just kill us? That would just kill us. Uh, might come back later. Tough. Mm, okay. What are we? Okay, how do we deal with this? In that case, we'll go get this gun first at Repcon. Hmm. Here we are. It's been my... Oh, no, but we need one more level for this. Because we need Science 75. Um, How close are we to that level? Still a ways. Good to have a sniper and a rocket. Ah, yeah, that, sound, that seems like a scary place. That seems like one of the hardest places in the game. Ugh. I'm, I'm a little bit worried about that part. <laughs> Let's, um... Mm, let's go here and go south because we need to find Cottonwood Cove anyway for a later. And we can just go there and then level up on the way. Hi. Hmm. Tough situation. I really should have leveled speech up early game. I realize now that this game just depends on you picking speech. There's so many things you can't do with, uh, with speech, without speech. Mm. Bunch of viper gangers out there, I believe. Good opportunity to level. There's a lot of them. Wow. Easy times. Snipers are so easy. It makes it so much better to have a sniper. That's nice. Oh, there's one left. Where though? Maybe further down? Mm -hmm. Oh, grenade rifle. Yeah, that might have been really tough. A broken grenade rifle. Why do I keep finding them with broken grenade rifle? They always have them, but they're always like near broken. Mm -hmm. All right, got to do it for the levels, boys. Oh, that's different enemies. Lots of stuff around. Aim practice. Watch me get rid of both of these in one hit each. Hey, that's one. I messed up. <laughs> I messed up big. <laughs> All right. So for the boon quest later, we have to discover Cottonwood Cove. And now that we need a level, we might as well walk there. Nice little stroll, you know? Nice little wasteland adventure. Oh, who are you? They stand? Oh. Oh. 
Oh, big horners are great experience. Nice. There we go. Lots of things over there, but I think it's Gex and I don't want to deal with it. Geckos in this game are surprisingly strong. They're really resilient to laser rifles. Don't like that. <laughs> More big horners. It's hunting season. Time to gun them down, boys. Oh, that's a good place for hunting, all right. There we go, that's one level. Sign 75, then we start on speech. There we go, nice. I just want to get speech to a decent level before we progress. We almost never get crits, that's the weird part. I feel like I do a lot to try and get crits, to like maximize our chance of crits. But in practice, I feel like we never get them. I don't know why that is. There we go. This is just a slaughter. I actually feel a bit sad for the big horners. Is that still a big horner or is that something else? Don't be a death claw. Don't be a death claw. Okay, no, we're good. Still good. Watch me get it. Ah! There we go. Oh! I like how hungry we are for experience. Everything we see, we're like, kill, kill. More big horners? Because I'll take a big horner. There's something here, and it's close by. Don't know what it is, though. A little worrying. What was that noise? Did you hear that noise? Was it just Veronica? Oh, that was scary. That was so scary. Okay. Oh, there's an enemy and it's a person? A ghoul. Huh. A whole bit of ghouls? Okay. Fine with me. Experience is experience. They're NCR goals. They're strong goals. They are looking each other up first. What are you doing? Okay, moving on. This is really good. We're really leveling. I think we need one more level and then we can start doing things. 
But of course we want to discover Cottonwood Cove real quick. Are we close yet? We're getting close. Is this that is this that place that uh where everything became toxic? The toxic place? Is that what this is? Yeah, this is that place. Are those friendlies? Nope. Okay, well, we're gonna go around because we gotta find Cottonwood Cove. Are you shooting? Squeeze me! You got a lot of attacks in- Oh! Stay away from Ronnie! Oh, Ronnie is- can handle herself. Wow. Okay, Ron. Damn. Good job. She's really good at this. It's a glowing one. go setting us up for the later game more enemies Ron got this don't you run there we go wow she's strong I hope she never dies I hope she never ever dies because I she's great she's amazing Yes, yes, it's a long walk. We're going to find Anders here, which there is a quest to retrieve him. But I don't want to get involved with that now. I'm just going to leave him. This is grisly. This is... Ugh. Hi. Halt! What business... Mark of Kaiser. You were the Mark of Kaiser. You may continue. For now. There we go. Uh-huh. Alright. In this case, we go get our gun. Then we go and try it. I'm a little bit worried about this whole brotherhood thing. So we need, we need to go here for two reasons. We're at Repcon. There's one great gun we need. Uh, the best plasma gun in the game. And there's also one of the things we need to collect for the Brotherhood. So we're here for a good reason. We've already tried, but it turned out we needed more than we thought we did. Valid facial pattern detect. We needed Luck 7 in order not to break out a fight. For this, we can get in here, but we need uh, very hard, very hard. So we need a hundred of one of them, which we cannot currently get to. But what we are looking for is on a different floor. It's on the third floor, I believe. Hello. See, I don't want to have to fight all these things. 
And having luck seven is just nice. Extra crits, etc. Intelligence seven isn't gonna do anything. I realized. Yeah, this is the Brotherhood people. Hi. Third floor access is free to Ice cream. Thank you, ma'am. See, there we go. Of course, I'm going to take their power armor. Which is going to be a, a hard to carry. But she can wear them? You're making me carry the heavy stuff, aren't you? Can she? Yo! She's wearing it! They don't have uh, helmets? Oh. Sad story. Very cool, Ronnie. Ooh, got some Very cool. Money. Is it a dress? Super, super cool. Wow. Nice. Okay. How do we get to the gun? Where is the gun? Easy safe. Who has an easy safe? You're the Repcon guy. You can't have an easy safe. Uh, yep. Yep. I'll take that. I guess. Mm -hmm. Let's get in here. I'm gonna say, uh, trusted. Okay. No. No, damn, that could be it. Uh, trusted. That could be it, and then grouped. Grouped. Yep, there we go. Excellent hackers. Hacker number one. Oh, okay. Yeah, okay. Well, we're just looking to for the gun. Where is it? Ah, oh, very hard. Damn. Wait. How do we do it? I know I've done it without having that skill. I know I've done it without having a skill high enough. Uh, is this the only way? Wait. Very hard, but then there's a password, right? Hmm. Let's see. Let's see if we can find a password somewhere. Maybe at the executive level? What did we find in the safe? We only found, like, money things. Whiskey, clipboard, random cabinet with nothing. Hmm. Where? How does it work? Maybe we have to come back with Science 100. Third floor access is free. This is just a way out. Huh. I thought there would be something for that. Very hard, can't do that. It's the only way to have science? That sucks. Right, we get in here. What? Huh. 
Okay, well, this is also not what I expected. But at least we got those Brotherhood things. We did want those. And what's in here then? Also the second floor. Huh. No, I don't know. I am stumped. Maybe last time I had lockpick. Because I know these are locked. And so these three are all locked. There has to be... It has to be something in there. And they're average locks, so I think I had that lockpick skill. Hmm. Well. We'll have to wait even longer for this one. Science 100. That's a lot. Well, it is what it is. Can't be helped. I know. Ah, I wish I could. Too bad. Suppose we can get up to 90 and then use a skill book. Wow, look at you. Alright, let's go meet the Brotherhood then. Mm -hmm. Wait, do we have skill? F do we have speech 50? Did we get speech 50 yet or not yet? 39. No, we can't even do it. Oh! We can't even fix it with a skill book yet. Because we need 20. Ah! We're caught in the middle. We're truly caught in the middle. In that case, maybe we'll go to the boomers because we need to go there too. Um, but that won't get us any experience. Hmm. Um. I think maybe. Oh. I think maybe we'll just make some money at the craps, and then we'll give Mr. House his thing as well. Ish. If we go to Mr. House and we give him his stuff, that might really help as well. Because this might give us, like, experience points? Can't be sure. It'll give us money at least. Oh, you guys gotta wait here. My bad. You know, I've been thinking. The real problem with the Brotherhood is that we isolate ourselves. Our training is top-notch, our technology gives us an advantage, but when it all comes down to it, we're losing because we shun the outside world. Yes. We always make enemies, never allies. We refuse to recruit outsiders or see the value in their simpler technologies. I agree. Why don't you do something about it? I don't know. I'm still thinking about what kind of role we could take on that would give us the best chance of survival. But I think things are starting to come together. I know the odds aren't good, but I gotta try. I can't lose them. Yeah. Alright. Should've brought something. You got something to read, I gave it to you. Let's talk to House. Where to, partner? Hmm. The penthouse. We get 2k from her. Well, hello, sugar. Goodbye. Be advised. Visitors will be held responsible for the behavior of any. So, Benny has been handled, and you've recovered the platinum chip. Let's have it. Yep. Such a small thing, isn't it? Here you go. And yet so capacious. So very dear. Decades of hiring salvagers out west. Are we gonna go with Mr. House? Relic 
in the ruins of a place called Sunnyvale. Back then, anyway. That's where the chip was printed, on October 22nd, 2077. It was to have been hand-delivered to me here at the Lucky 38 the next day. But the bombs fell first. Suffice it to say, the delivery was never made. What does it do? Some things are more easily shown than... Don't worry. Yeah, yeah, he's gonna give us the whole spiel. Step closer to the demonstration area, if you would. I expect you're well familiar with my Securitrons by now. The titanium alloy housing that protects its electronic core deflects small arms that shrapnel easily enough. Its X-25 Gatling laser produced to spec by Glassing House Inc. is deadly against soft targets at deadly. medium range. And for close range suppression or crowd control, the Securitron is armed with a 9mm submachine gun. All of this you probably already knew. What you did not know is that these are the Securitron's secondary weapons. All this time, my Securitrons have had to get by running the Mark I operating system, which lacked software drivers for their primary weapons. Mm -hmm. Today, with the delivery of the Platinum chip, yeah. all that changes. Wow. Behold, for the first time, Securitrons running the Mark II OS. The M235 missile launcher gives the Securitron the ability to engage ground and air targets at significantly longer ranges. And a rapid-fire G-28 grenade ensures the Securitron is deadly in close-range engagements. The software upgrade also includes drivers for the Securitron's highly sophisticated onboard auto repair systems. Mm. Altogether, the Mark II software upgrade confers a 235% increase in combat effectiveness per unit. Wow. The city of New Vegas finally has soldiers worthy of protecting it. Return to the penthouse now. We have much to discuss. Very cool. Trips to the basement are rarely so educational. I've since broadcast the upgrade to him. Yes, 600. Just like, like we hoped. Ah, not enough. Okay. Why show your hand like that? I'm surprised you can still underestimate me after everything you've seen. <laughs> I haven't shown my hand. I've shown one card. I've given my enemies a single provocative datum upon which to fixate. Hmm. They have no idea what other cards I'm holding. It's a strong hand, believe me. I dealt it to myself. What happens next? To secure the future of New Vegas, I must have your assistance. The work ahead is dangerous, but you weather danger well. What did What are your plans for New Vegas? I've resurrected Vegas, spirit intact. What I need now is the ability to enforce my rightful claim. Not just against Caesar's Legion, by the way. In fact, the NCR is a more present and insidious threat. How do you intend to enforce your claim? To enforce, one must have force. A position of strength. Years ago, when I detected NCR scouts roaming the Mojave, I could tell from their uniforms that these were no mere tribesmen. I knew it was only a matter of time before an army appeared to take control of the dam. And I knew my Securitrons wouldn't be enough to oppose them. And so I recruited the three families. Vegas belongs to me because I mustered enough strength to bring the NCR to the bargaining table. Wasn't the NCR's army big enough to defeat your Securitrons? Indeed it was, and still is, but not without taking significant casualties. Would Kimball and Oliver have traded the lives of hundreds of soldiers for absolute control of Hoover Dam? Oh, yes. 
They weren't afraid of me. They were afraid of Caesar, that attacking me would leave them vulnerable to a legion offensive. And so they negotiated, not out of the kindness of their hearts, as they try to make it seem, because the calculus of power left no other choice. Well, what was the treaty like? NCR forces were permitted to occupy Hoover Dam and establish a military base at McCarran Airport. They recognized my sovereignty over the Vegas Strip and agreed to supply electricity and water once their engineers repaired the dam. Written into the treaty were provisions that the NCR do nothing to prevent its soldiers and civilians. That's how I harness the NCR to my endeavor. Their occupation has been the engine of my growing economy. You would go to war? The salient issue is that they will go to war with me, if given the chance. There's just one reason why the NCR hasn't contrived some outrage to justify invading the Strip. Caesar's Legion. Hmm. The final battle between those two armies is fast approaching. I can't afford to let either side win on their terms. What else did you want to discuss? It is really interesting. What's the deal with the snow globe collection? What of it? I enjoy them. There's something about a little diorama set inside a glass. If you run across any out in... What else? What's Vegas like before the war? It was a place of splendor. As magnificent as today's strip may seem, it's but a shadow of the neon paradise. I grew up not far from here, and though I traveled the old world extensively, I never found another place like it. You say that you saved Las Vegas, how? By 2065, I deemed it a mathematical certainty that an atomic war would devastate the Earth within 15 years. Every projection I ran confirmed it. I knew I couldn't save the world, nor did I care to, but I could save Vegas, and in the process, perhaps save mankind. I set to work immediately. I thought I had plenty of time to prepare. As it turned out, I was 20 hours short. What preparations did you make? On the day of the Great War, 77 atomic warheads targeted Las Vegas and its surrounding areas. My networked mainframes were able to predict and force transmit disarm code subsets to 59 warheads, neutralizing them before impact. Laser cannons mounted on the roof of the Lucky 38 destroyed another nine warheads. The rest got through, though none hit the city itself. A suboptimal performance, admittedly. If only the platinum chip had arrived a day sooner. Why didn't it arrive on time? The Platinum Chip was printed in Sunnyvale, California on October 22nd, 2077, the day before the Great War. It was to have been delivered by courier the following afternoon, but by then, the world had ended. The chip contained vital software upgrades, but not just for my Securitrons. Every aspect of the missile defense grid would have been upgraded too. Given that I had to make do with buggy software, the outcome could have been worse. I nearly died as it was. How did you nearly die? Wow, software this is interesting. Software set off a cascade of system crashes. I had to take the Lucky 38's reactor offline, lest it melt down. For nearly five years, I battled power outages and more system crashes until I finally managed to reboot my data core with an older version of the OS. I spent the next few decades in a veritable coma, but I survived, obviously, and eventually thrived. Wow. How will NCR defend Hoover Dam? General Oliver's strategy, or tunnel vision, as I like to call it, has been to mass troops at Hoover Dam. He wants to outfight the Legion in a straightforward slugging match, and then, when they rout, pursue and destroy them in detail. A crushing, decisive victory of this sort would overshadow the tactical ingenuity of Chief Hanlon's defense four years ago, you see. What's your battle plan for the dam? A good deal should be obvious to you by now. 
I won't spoil the rest by talking out of turn. Let's talk about that mission. The next step will require you to infiltrate Caesar's camp at Fortification Hill. He's already invited me. I'm not surprised. The Legion has spies on the Strip. What will I find? I want you to open a hatch in hey, the Alesso. basement of the derelict What's up? weather welcome, station welcome. atop Fortification Hill. You'll recognize it on sight. The hatch bears the logo of the Lucky 38, same as the Platinum chip. I'll do as you ask. Here, take the Platinum. Upon arrival at the fort, it's likely that you'll be searched <laughs> and the chip taken from you. Don't worry. It will come back to you. All right. That was actually a really interesting bit of lore. Some of it we already heard once, but a lot of it we hadn't heard yet. So that was really, really cool. I'm actually kind of starting to like Mr. House. And Alesso, you just came in, but we I'm just leaving. This has been it for today. Thank you for tuning in to Teddy's New Vegas Permadeath Experience. We are going to save over this i want to see what it calls us what kind of person are we? are we still a vagabond of the wastes a desert avenger level nine guys thank you for tuning in we will be back alesso see you maybe next time bye bye